Hey guys, welcome back. Today, uh, just a real quick video, uh, some announcements I missed from Analog. And let's go over them real fast. So, we updated about pre-orders. So this looks like may not be the greatest news if you're in Group C or beyond, but all open pocket pre-orders, including Group C and beyond, and new pre-orders placed today, which was two days ago on February 7th, will ship in 2023. Pretty vague. Uh, so that's not super exciting because you're only guaranteed to get them by the end of the year, which kind of sucks. Uh, all open Super NT and Mega SG pre-orders and any new pre-orders placed today, again, this was February 7th, will ship in quarter two, 2023. So a little bit better news if you had ordered a Super NT and Mega SG. It looks like you will be guaranteed to have it before the end of quarter two. Uh, as we already know, Analog OS is currently in beta. Uh, it says with library memories alongside significant extra features. Uh, don't know the significant extra features, but all of the firmwares they've been uploading have been betas basically for the pocket for a while now um i think we're on beta 7 uh, this is where it gets a little bit more interesting development schedule original display modes q2 2023 and dac support which i'm assuming means for the pocket quarter two 2023 so unfortunately that's going to take so long but it looks like we will finally get dac support for the pocket and quarter two, which is pretty cool. And then they say for open FPGA uh, is actively being developed to meet developer feature requests and add new analog features. This will continue into the future. So uh, not sure what analog has in store for their own features. Uh, it looks like they do plan on continuing support be interesting if analog os makes it to any other devices they've released so far uh could make you know the super nt and mega sg pretty interesting if that by chance ever happened um we're still waiting on the turbo duo uh the only thing i don't understand is they keep discontinuing items and so i don't know what the plan is there like seems like a weird business model like hey let's r d a bunch of cool devices and then we're going to discontinue them so not sure what their plan is there maybe eventually that they'll just create their own version of the mister or something using analog os uh which would be kind of cool but yeah kind of interesting because i know the super nt and mega sg have not gotten uh any updates i think since 2021 i think so uh, yeah, it'd be cool to see some updates to, to some of the other devices they have out there. Cause so far it just seems like they're all in on the pocket, which is cool for the pocket, but be really sweet if they also added some, uh, cool features back to some of these other devices and updated them also. So anyway, that's all I have for now. I will see you in the next video.